Oh no, they killed him in the shower. Oh, I wonder if he dropped the soap. All right, welcome back to Starfield. Been a bit, sorry about that. Anyway, last time we got initiated into the Crimson Fleet. And this time we're gonna partake in our first mission forum. Don't exactly know what that's gonna be like. Hopefully I don't have to kill anybody. No matter how much I want to, Sistev got mad last time. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and do that, so. Well, let's meet this Delgado guy. Ah, there is our other new recruit. What's up? So, now that we are all here, it's time to get down to business. I oh, love business. The two of you are the only rooks that have made the latest cut. The rest, well, let's just say they won't be joining us ever again. Oh. Neighbor's willing to put her neck on the line and vouch for you, which means you've got what it takes to join the Crimson Fleet. Oh, don't worry. I, I won't disappoint. And uh, let me just say this. I ain't wearing a wire, okay? All right. Let's get started here. When you sign up with the Crimson Fleet, you're in it for the long haul. No one quits. No one retires. The only way out is death. You stay loyal or you pay the consequences. Fleet before friends. Fleet before family. Fleet before yourself. That's a lot. You know, I hope that doesn't include fleet before because I like to get Hey, if you've got a problem, I can decorate that wall behind you with your brains. Room could use a little color if you ask me. It's all right, neighbor. I admire this Rook's backbone. Takes a lot of guts to crack jokes with the threat of death staring them in the face. I was serious. Can we get on with this? I want to get drunk at the last Nova. I'm impressed. That is the first intelligent thing you have said this entire time, Mathis. Since you two seem so eager to move forward, let's get to your next job. Pack your cold weather gear, Rooks. Oh, sh Where we are going, you're going to need it. Oh, God, don't tell me you're dragging him down to Suvaral for another one of your little initiation runs. You think by now you would have given up on that goddamn campfire story? Crix's legacy is no story, neighbor. We've got fresh eyes in the fleet. And if these two want to impress, they're going to help me search those ruins. I hope you're right, Dale. This initiation, as Neva calls it, is your chance to see where it all began. On Suvorov with Jasper Crix. Crix led the riots that gave birth to the Crimson Fleet. Okay. And if his legacy is still out there, we're going to be the ones to find it. Before Crix left the fleet, he left a message talking about a major score. One that would set up the fleet to be a big player in the settled systems. Somewhere down the line, they started calling it Crix's legacy. And everyone who's tried to find it has wound up empty-handed, missing, or dead. Oh. If we're gonna beat those odds, we'll first need a lead. And I would wager we will find one on Subarov. Dale's leaving out the best part. That this whole search is based on a handful of words on a very old slate. <laughs> Don't listen to her. When we get our hands on Crix's legacy, the fleet will be operating at a completely different level. We will become more than a match for UC Sistef. Oh, so what you're saying is we'll be unstoppable. Exactly. Oh. Now you're beginning to understand. That's not good. Okay, enough discussion. We have got a lot of work to do. Oh, look. I guess I'm stuck in the ceiling, Andresia. I guess we're, uh, going down to the planet. Whew, it's cold. About time you got here. I told you you were wasting your time, Dell. Oh, Dell likes the computer, and I thought you liked surprises. I hate surprises. I'll keep that in mind. Just do what I say, and you might even walk away from this. And Mathis, I am running things around here, so keep your mouth shut. We are here to dig up any info about Griggs's legacy. That uh, sounds simple. Um, too simple. <laughs> so simple, even a rook like you can't screw it up. Bet. 
Your little friend can tag along until we get to the outer doors of the prison, but I will be damned if I'm letting them inside. Whoa. <sighs> fine, fine, go on. Leave me. Just be sure and thaw me out when you return. So let's get moving. It is chilly and icy. Don't don't slip. This place is a hole. Oh god. Why are you running? God, a bunch of You know, if you guys don't hurry up, I'm gonna kill you too. Oh, hey guys, do I push this button? It didn't work. Here we are. The place where Jasper Griggs laid the groundwork for finding the legacy, and eventually, the Crimson Fleet. The lock. <laughs> we are in. Let's go. Ah, it is a good day, yes? Uh, sorry, Andresia, I wish you could come, but he's a dickhead. First time I have been inside this part of the lock, so keep your eyes open. Could you imagine being stuck under a ton of ice like this for the rest of your life? Yeah, I can imagine. Wait, shut up a second! Did you hear that? Nope. No payday's worth this! Let's More go! Least Oh, guys, these are nothing. See, this is why we should have brought Andresia. She loves killing. Must be a nest. I bet these things are crawling all over the place. Yeah, and their bodies probably heard us firing from about a kilometer away. Hallelujah. Not to state the obvious, but sounds like you need to grow a pair. And fast, because you have nothing down there. If we weren't on this job with Delgado, I'd drop you for saying that. Let's go. Enough already. Since you are such good friends, why don't you and Mathis head up to that control room and see if you can get some more of these doors open? I'd be careful with what you ask for because only one of us might come back. Son of a, the whole roof's coming down! God damn, damn it. it. God damn it, we're cut off. Maybe your jaw can break it. There's no way we're getting through here. Nope, didn't do anything. Well, this is just great. The hell are we supposed to do now? How about you shut up and let me think, okay? What's there to think about? Let's face it, we're on our own now. Well, considering there's the threat of death, let's just continue with the plan, Del Lago's orders. Why? Because that's what his loyal little soldiers are supposed to do? The hell with that. I have a better plan. Great. We use this opportunity to take out Delgado, and at the same time, make some serious credits for ourselves. How do you suppose we would do that, huh? We hit him. All right, I'm on board for now. Playing it safe, huh? I can respect that. Can you though? <laughs> well, we could just crawl through here, right? No, that's no, a video game. Hello. Oh, look at this. Oh. Is anyone up there? Nope. Quit screwing around and pick up. Maybe I don't wanna. Okay, fine. So the two of you made it, huh? Barely. I want you to keep looking for a way to open the rest of the doors down here. Otherwise, I'm not going anywhere. And second, try and dig up whatever you can about Jasper Griggs. You both got that? Yeah, we got it. Yeah? You'd better. And tell Mathis not to get any bright ideas, or I will gut him myself. Got it. Where is Mathis? Mathis! Attention. Lockdown mode has been rescinded. That's good, right? Hey, you okay? Not far from it, actually. Looks like there's a guard tower overlooking the cell block. We should check it out. Okay. You're mine! Mathis, you okay? So, have you thought about what I've said? Hey, listen. Quit bringing it up or you're gonna get us both killed, dumbass. Yeah, right. We just have to get our hands a little dirty. Wouldn't be the first time, am I right? Buddy, do you not wash your hands after you wipe? That's disgusting. Well, we're kind of on the clock here. So, now that we've made it to the guard tower, what's our next move, genius? Hey, this was your idea, but we should locate his cell and search for hidden information. Been in a few slams yourself, I see. Sure, probably not. Cell D03118, okay. It's a place to start, I guess. Oh, that's a lot of numbers. I think it's like four of them. Hey, Mathis. Come here. Yeah, come here. I want to show you something. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that over there. Just, just look at that. Oh, very impressive. 
Oh, shit. Oh, God damn it. Dumbass. Oh, God, you clogged the toilet. So this is where he shit. All right, anything useful in here? Oh, yeah, break the lamp. Best laid plans. Today, I bumped into someone in the mess hall yapping about a ship carrying a fortune in credits. I found out the ship was a Gal Bank transport named Legacy that went down in some remote system during the war. I need to contact Carter to let him know it's time to get off this rock. He'll help the mining details slip into the utility closet and ventilation room. That's where we'll dig. Not up. But through, <laughs> right to the armory. For now, we'll continue using his locker in the showers area as a drop point for the code to the utility closet. By this time next month, I should be out of this dump and uploading those creds into my account. Well, we got the information. Okay, Carter. Confirming that the latest code to the utility room is 48611071. We get one shot at this. If we play our cards right, this gets us one step closer to that fortune that went down with the legacy. Oh no, they killed him in the shower. Oh, I wonder if he dropped the soap. Huh, I wonder what's behind here. Whoops. Oh. Ah, Jesus Christ, you scared me. God, there's a lot of dead people. And I didn't do it. I didn't put them here. This was the warden's office. I hope you found something because I am getting sick and tired of this place. I found the information about Crix's legacy. No thanks to Mathis over here who barely lifted his dick. I knew it. Hey, what the hell? Everyone said I was out of my mind, but something told me we'd find the answers down here. Looks like I picked the right person for the job. This is bullshit, Delgado. I help plenty. Liar. Is that Mathis? Tell him to shut up. I will deal with him later. Now all we have to do is find a way off of this planet. I'm looking at schematics for the lock. And I don't think there's a way to get you back to the surface from there. Oh. But I can open the outer doors to the shuttle bay and let you fly one of the shuttles down there directly up to the key. All right. You got it, boss. Good answer. You're learning fast. Shuttle bay activated. Might take a while, though. Those bay doors have not been opened in almost a century. You have done a hell of a job, Rook. We will talk when you get back to the key. Why the hell did you lie to Delgado about me? You didn't do all this work alone. Yeah, I did. Don't change the subject, asshole. You've been trying to get me to kill him this whole time. About all that killing Delgado stuff, why don't we just forget about everything that I said? You know, like it never happened. I'll think about it, Mathis. I'll think about it. Oh, you're gonna be like that, huh? Yep. Well, I guess I deserve it. Yeah, you do. Now, let's get the heck out of here. Well, I take it that's our ship. Ooh, bugs. Come here. Oh, what the f***? That thing is massive. That's what she said. F me, son of a They have a queen. Oh, oh, oh. I didn't like that. All right, come here, come here. Get on the get on the floor. That is right. Oh, that is that's right. That's that's gonna leave a heart. Whew! You were scary. Oh, it's uh, it's open. Oh, watch out, debris! Saved your life. Um, how does one? get inside uh sh god damn it Bethesda oh I I love Bethesda's janky ass buggy ass Oh my god, I made it out. F***ing hell. Okay, where's my ship? Oh, wait, where's Andresia? Uh, Orbit stabilizing. 
All right, let's get back on here and finish this up. Easy peasy. Lemon, squeeze me. It is almost impressive oh, that the Crimson Fleet has managed to maintain I'm, this place. I missed, not you, get the f*** out of here. I missed you and your, I didn't mean to push you over. Put him in a chokehold. Hey, Del Dago or whatever. There you are. The hell took you so long? It's about time. I was about to fly down and loot your bodies. I got stuck. Not now, neighbor. Well, you said you found something. Hand it over. What a thank you be so difficult, man. I mean, come on, it's two words. Thank you. Oh, excuse me. Forgive my impertinence. Okay, that's a big word. What I meant to say was, give me whatever you found right now before I blow your goddamn head off. Please. I'd love to watch you try. Just cut the crap and give them what you found. <sighs> Fine, take it. Just know that I had to store it in my ass. Well, I'll be damned. Just one slate. Yeah. After losing so much of our crew, it better be a map with a big red X on it. It is. Legacy wasn't referring to Crix's fortune. It's the name of an actual ship. A Galbank transport probably loaded with credits. Okay, this changes things. Now that we know what we are looking for, we have to narrow the search. I mean, that ain't much to go on, but it's something. Well, that is not necessarily true. Oh. Let us start with what we know. Yeah. It was a Galbank ship. Which means the company is going to have records of where it went down. I see where you're going. Neva, weren't you working on a deal with Rokov? Something about a big wig charity event on one of Trident Starliners? Are you serious? I've been working on that gig for three months. That's my score. Ay Dios mío. Will you shut up about your score and think for a second? That Starliner has a Galbank VIP suite aboard. Which means... Come on, Neva. This isn't hard. Yeah, unlike me. Which means a Gal Bank exec will be aboard. We grab their credentials and get ourselves into the Gal Bank archives in New Atlantis. Holy sh! That might actually work. Huh? I'll send a message to Rokov right away. Pack your bags, Rook. You're going on vacation. I mean, cool. You know, I've always wanted to take a deep space cruise, relax. Go commando, walk around the ship naked, all the fun stuff. Good, because that is exactly what you are going to be doing. Oh, good. I need you to board that ship, make contact with Rokov, and get me those credentials. You can count on me, dip Oh, before you leave, I wanted you to know that I took what you said about Mathis into consideration, and I've decided to cut him from the fleet. Well, that's annoying. I wanted to watch him get killed. That's it, then. Damn it. Next stop for you is Rokov Starliner, the Siren of the Stars. And remember, Rokov does not need to know anything about Grix's legacy. For now, it's just between us. Now get out of here. Hey, Rook, before you head out, I need to have a word with you. Meet me at the last Nova after you wrap things up with Mathis. Oh, I guess I have to speak to Mathis? Oh, no, I'm lost. Oh, I'm fine. Pirates and alcohol. What could go wrong in a place like this? So much, but also, so much could go right. Would you like a drink? Mathis! Hey, I want to talk to you. I bet. Thanks to you, Delgado's cutting me from the fleet. Well, you know what? You better get your own fleet, because I'm coming after you. Give it your best shot, Mathis. I dare you. I double dare you, mother. Oh, I will, I can promise you that. Best part is, you won't even see it coming. Oh, I'm so ready. But you have just told us that you will attempt it. Do you not consider that counterproductive if you mean to ambush us? Oh my god, good one, Andresia. Where the hell's Andresia? What are you... Okay. All right, well, I'm gonna call it a part there. Pretty eventful, we're gonna be finding some treasure. Uh, so next time, we're going to be continuing this quest, and I think we're going to be um, doing a little uh, soiree on a cruise liner in space. Anyway, if you could please like and subscribe, that would really help. Grow the channel, fight the YouTube algorithm. That's an absolute win. You can check out some other videos right on the screen here. Comment, dislikes, those help too. And come back next time.